Yo, greetings guys, welcome to another episode of The Breakdown with Chop Boy DJ RSC. On today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to actually uh, manipulate a sample to make it sound like yours, you know, so that it doesn't sound like the original sample that you got from wherever that you got it, maybe from a sample pack, splice, loop cloud, uh, session loops, or whatever. I'm gonna come to my Afro House and tag sample pack. So I'm gonna look for some nice percussion loops. So I like this. I like the sounds in the sample, but I don't want it to sound in the same groove, basically. So I'm just gonna come here. I'm gonna right click on this and I'm gonna say, uh, open a new fruity slicer. And then it has sliced it up like that. And then what I'll do is just on the attack, I'll just take the attack a little bit higher. Just like that, all right? Just like that, and then from here, I'm gonna select all, delete, and then from there I'm gonna open this sample. Well, so now I'm gonna create the new loop. So let's try this. So let's say I'm gonna make it like an AMA piano loop. So I'm gonna put it maybe on 113 there and then let's do this. I like that. We can have the shaker coming in somewhere in between. Maybe it can even go like that. You know? not, not like that, like that. And I can even decrease these things, these shakers down. And you listen up to, to what you think is dope. So I can put this here and then I can have something like this. So now let's compare. I found it like this. And I made it this. And if you feel like, oh, uh, changing up a little bit so you just come to here and you can actually change the key of the whole thing and then now you can say okay I want it to be a few semitones less so I'm gonna make it minus 200 maybe and you can pick it up I think that makes sense I hope that makes sense to you guys you can also do it with the melodies as well so I'm gonna load this, uh, a melody from from my sample pack as well. So um, let's let's see what we have. So I like this card. So let's try to see what we can do with this card. So we'll do the same thing. Open a new fruity slicer channel, and then we're gonna come here, select all, and then delete, and then. Let's see if it's possible to deal with it now. Another thing, you can also come here and say auto select so it puts it on the key on the right BPM and then now you can just So now I have something like this. Now you can even mess it up a little bit and also maybe say, okay, I needed 300 cents up, right? And then
and from there you can actually create a new song from out of whatever that you started you know so i think this so i hope this is helpful and guys i'll see you guys on my next tutorial don't forget to like share comment and peace